नमो भगवते वासुदेवाय ओ नमो भगवते वासुदेवाय चैतन्य भागवत टू जीरो फाइव चैप्टर थर्टीन द डिलीवरेंस ऑफ जगायन माधाई बाय श्रील वृंदावन दास ठाकुर वी हैव सीन हाउ सीइंग द एक्स्ट्रॉर्डिनरी and uh, un uh, never seen before uh, deliverance of jagai uh, madhai became very much changed uh, and uh, totally changed miraculous change in madhai instead of trying to hit nityananda again he turned into a very humble devotee uh, this kind of a revolution of heart can only be brought about by nityananda gauranga and their holy names uh, so madhai already has recited two verses uh, he got back his intelligence actually the human form of life the intelligence is made to actually petition the lord for his mercy we are misusing our intelligence in trying to become god but actually the intelligence should be used to pray to the lord for his mercy and jagai seeing jagai's deliverance madhai uh, immediately became sumati instead of kumati and uh, he started uh, all the energy all the intelligence he had he desperately prayed started praying to gauranga to deliver him he says that we have both committed sinful activities together and why do you divide us uh, in bestowing your mercy please my dear lord anugraha please have anugraha on me most callless mercy on me so that i can chant your holy names i am so so much sinful that uh, that uh, that if you don't have mercy i won't be able to even pick up the beads and chant your holy name i won't be able to even chant in kirtan uh, if you don't have mercy on me they sometimes you want to ask when will i get the mercy but actually the very fact that we are practicing nam yoga bhakti yoga means that we already have a, some mercy some tiny drop uh, of mercy because for uh, chanting also madha is asking mercy and he said that my dear lord nobody will deliver this is the first argument is we both are the same why are you dividing why are you discriminating second uh, if you give me mercy then only i can chant the names and third my without you my dear lord nobody can ever deliver me no incarnation no form of god can deliver me because my sins are unforgivable so this is the third reason So three reasons, intelligent reasons. I mean, uh, uh, Madhai has put before the Lord, and what does the Lord reply? We will see today, text two zero five. Prabhu bole tor tran nahi dekhi muhi nityanand hange rakta padi le shi tuhi. Oh Madhai. Uh, i do not see your deliverance in the next billions of lives 
in fact never i don't see that you will be delivered because uh, the most merciful form in creation this form of nityananda you have shed blood from that form you have committed a grievous offense unpardonable even if you perform atonement for billions of lives i will never forgive this offense his body is nityananda he is totally harmless he is working day and night for the deliverance of all souls he did not come to attack you he came to save you akrodha paramananda nityanand rahe abhimana shunyanitai nagare vidai so abhimana shunya goranga may sometimes exhibit anger to correct a devotee but nityanand is totally intoxicated in love he never even displays divine anger uh, which he displayed in his previous past times of balaram so why do you have hurt harmed him so i i cannot forgive you ever मदाई बोलो ये इहा बलि देना पार आपनर धर्म प्रभु आपनी के ने छाड़ सो इट्स सच अ ग्रेट मिरेकल दैट मदाई हैज बिकम सो एजुकेटेड इन गौरांग तत्व इंस्टेंटली दिस इज द मर्सी ऑफ लॉर्ड गौरांग even the most sinful person can understand gauranga tattva instantly without here madai not did not read any books neither he uh, you know analyze the scriptures uh, he just saw gauranga's 400 form he saw the jagai was delivered basically nityananda prabhu desired that madai should be delivered that was a factor which totally uh, uh changed madai's life and he actually became so much aware of the goranga tattva without any preaching he when goranga said i can never deliver you then madai is putting forward his fourth argument he is saying iha bhalite na par my dear lord please please don't speak like this please please i beg you don't speak like this i am hopeless destitute if you don't deliver me i don't know what to do even suicide uh, is not uh, a recourse so i have committed so many sins and only you can purify them your name can purify but i cannot chant your name without your mercy so the fourth argument is then my dear lord if you do not deliver me then you are uh, the dharma uh, the the mission for which you have come in kaliyuga that mission you are escaping from that mission to deliver the most fallen you are giving up your own mission if you don't deliver me my dear lord vaane vindhi leka toma je asura gaane निज पद सास बारे तबे दिल के ने
Mother is arguing that my dear Lord, those are demons which uh, uh, wounded you with arrows. Uh, even you, those demons, you have given them mukti, liberation from bondage. Mm -hmm. Anyone uh, who even uh, has harmed you, you also you have delivered them. Putna came to kill you and put her poisonous breasts in your mouth. Uh, but uh, you uh, made him, made her a nurse in Goloka. So, uh, 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 please don't, uh, this is the fifth argument of Madai uh, that Nija Padrata Savare Tabedi Lekene that why did you give your lotus feet to them, those demons who tried to harm you? Uh, if you are given to them, you have to give it to me also. So Lord Gauranga immediately counteracted his fifth argument. Uh, Lord Gauranga said, Prabhu bale taha hoite tora parat Nityananda angete karili ratta paat Lord Gauranga said, Your offense is much much higher than those demons. Hmm? Cannot compare it. Because the demons hurt me, but you hurt my Nityananda. Who is more dear to me than my own self. So, uh, your offense is uh, unlimited. Don't compare yourself. The next verse is uh, 209. This uh, verse everyone should remember uh, because it is coming out from Lord Gauranga's lotus mouth. Hmm? And this is the ultimate truth which Lord Gauranga is expressing. Ama haite nityananda deha bada. Torasthane satya kahilama dadha. Gauranga Mahaprabhu said that this transcendental divine form of Nityananda Prabhu is even higher than my form. Huh? Is even higher than mine. Hmm. Oh Madhai, listen carefully. Torasthane, I am telling you this ultimate truth with all with full form, certitude. There is no doubt that is transcendent to divine form of Nityananda Prabhu is my life and soul. And it is even higher than my form. So, uh, unless one reads Chaitanya Bhagavad, one will never be able to understand this truth. Uh, uh, and this great secret. Mm. So, uh, you have harmed Nityananda, you have atta attacked his divine form. So, you, you have committed a bigger offense than even attacking me directly. That is what Chaitanya Bhagavat uh, also states in the beginning, the first chapter itself. Do you know uh, Vrindavandas what Thakur says? Amara Bhaktera Puja Amahaite Bada Vede Bhagavat Ara Shastre Kaila Dadra Dadha And even higher than my worship is the worship of my associates. All the Vedas and Bhagavatas. 
described. That is why Chaitanya Bhagavat is considered even higher than Shrimad Bhagavatam. Because in Shrimad Bhagavatam, uh, Chaitanya Bhagavatam and Chaitanya Charitamrita, these two books, holy books. So Shrimad Bhagavatam uh, explains the great glories of his associates uh, in Shantaras, in Dasyaras. The first nine cantos. Mm-hmm. But Chaitanya Bhagavat and Chaitanya Charitam, they directly talk about his associates in the highest mellows, who are his most intimate associates. All the gopis have come as uh, in the male divine form in the Gauranga's Leela. So since these two holy books described there, and Chaitanya Mangal, also three books, these three books uh, de- describe these glories of their of the Lord's most intimate associates. That is why is that they are higher than Srimad Bhagavat. Because here the Lord is saying, you know, my my associates are higher than me. So the more intimate they are, the more higher those pastimes are. The more uh, closer, uh, most elevated those pastimes are. And the tenth canto also Radha. Radha Rani is not directly described uh, because of Shukdev's mood. He was in divine rapture about Radha. So he could not speak about Radha. Otherwise he would have gone into a trance for six months. Mm. And then Parish would have been killed by the snake. So for the sake of his disciple, he did not describe about Srimati Radhika. But Shukdev is in Shantaras. Uh, he's a parrot. Whereas uh, Vrindavan Das Thakur is in Sakharas in Vrindavan. He is Kusuma Peed uh, Sakha. Uh, and Chaitanya Charita Amrit, uh, Krishna Das Kaviraj is Kasturi Manjari. He is uh, Madhuri Ras. Mm. And Chaitanya Mangal Lochan Das Thakur is also Manjari. Madhuri Ras. Navdeep Dham Mahatmya, the book written. Uh, if by Bhakti we know Thakur, he is also in Madhurya, he is Kamala Manjiri. Uh, and Chaitanya Chandramrita is a book written by Absolute Prabodhananda Saraswati, that is, um, he is uh, Tunga Vidya, one of the eight Sakis, that is also Madhurya. So all the Gauranga Leela books are higher. Uh, because they have been composed by most intimate devotees of Radha Krishna and Gauranga Nityananda Gauranga. Of course, it is absolute. All the pastimes of the Lord are absolute. Nothing is higher and nothing is lower. But speaking in a neutral sense, uh, uh, a Madhuri author like Krishnadas Kaviraj um, and uh, Vrindavan Das is Audarya. Chaitanya Bhagavat is Audarya and Chaitanya Charitamrita is Madhuri. Uh, so, uh, and Chaitanya Mangal is a mixture of both. Uh, so, uh, this uh, statement, which are even con- confidential, they are not found in Srimad Bhagavatam which are even confidential in Srimad Bhagavatam are found in Chaitanya Bhagavat. And this statement is that uh, uh, Lord Gauranga Mahaprabhu is himself saying that Amahai Teshe Nityananda Deha This form of Nityananda is even higher than in my form. Because he is Kripa and I am Daya. He gives Kripa he gives causeless mercy. I I give Jagai mercy only when Jagai because Jagai protected Nityananda. But Nityananda delivered them even before, even if you hit them. He sets no terms and conditions. So his form is higher than my form. His form is much more merciful than my form. Now this is absolute. How can we say Nityananda's form is actually coming from Gauranga's form, the first expansion. So how can you say that the expansion is more merciful than the original? But that is the uh, 
that is the speciality of the original form that the original form can create a even more merciful form than its own achintya bheda me tattva that uh, even the nityananda prabhu is expansion of goranga is foremost servant of goranga still uh, his form is uh, his form is considered by goranga higher than himself text 210 सत्यादी कहिल ठाकुर मोर स्थाने बल निष्कृति मुई पाइव के माने द फिफ्थ आर्ग्यूमेंट ऑफ गुड मदाई वॉज मैश बाय गौरंग बाय सेंग दैट गौरंग सेट दैट नित्यानंद फॉर्म इज you committed a bigger offense much bigger offense than killing the demon I and mean, the demons i didn't mind delivering the demons because they attacked me directly but i will never deliver you because you attacked nityanand so madai uh, put forward an even stronger argument push forward he knew now his you know his Uh, his propositions are not working, mm. and so only his only hope was that Gorang would expect accept his proposal to surrender. So ultimately, he said, "Satya yadi kahila thakuru marastan." Okay, my dear Lord, I accept that you are telling me the truth. Mm. I accept that, but. Uh, but then if that is the truth that you will never deliver me then my dear lord then tell me when a sinful soul like me when the soul will be delivered when when will when will the sinful soul like me be delivered please tell me that nobody will deliver me no incarnation no form and nityanand prabhu also will not deliver me unless you don't forgive me So you tell me who will deliver me then? When you know, like when a positive doesn't work, when a when a positive proposal doesn't work, then you have to ask a question. You know, uh, Madhav is trying with all means to uh, text two hundred and eleven. Sarvaroga nasha vidya chuda mani tu mi. तुम्ही रोग चिकित्सिले शुष्ट दिस इज अ वेरी ब्यूटिफुल सेवेंथ आर्ग्यूमेंट नाउ मदर इज यूजिंग एन एनालॉजी ही ट्राइड फाइव स्ट्रेट फॉरवर्ड आर्ग्यूमेंट सिक्स वन ही ट्राइड टू आस्क द क्वेश्चन टू द लॉर्ड प्रपोजल हु विल डिलीवर मी एंड सेवेंथ नाउ ही इज यूजिंग एन एनालॉजी टू ट्राई टू चेंज द माइंड ऑफ द लॉर्ड He says, "My dear Lord, you are the crush jewel of all Ayurvedic doctors, <laughs> of all uh, uh, Vaidyas, uh, of all uh, natural, you know, of all healers. Mm-hmm. You are the uh, ultimate crush jewel of all physicians. Mm-hmm. So." you have a medicine for every disease in creation every problem in creation you have the solution otherwise you won't be god the very fact that you are god it means that you can solve anything so my dear lord okay okay i have an unforgivable crime i have committed on for you and i am accepting that and i am you know really crying uh and i know there is no no atonement there is no solution but my dear lord you can solve even this you can you can provide a solution to even this because you are the ultimate solution provider even the 
those uh, problems or even those uh, sins or even those obstacles which cannot be eradicated by anything. You can do it because you are God. If you diagnose me, diagnose me and you prescribe, treat me, you treat me with the medicine of your mercy, causeless mercy, then I will surely be cured. Text 112. Nakara kapata prabhu samsare ranat vidita hailara lukai bhakat and the last argument which Madha is giving, I think this is the clinching argument. Uh, uh, it's number eight. Mm. And Madha is saying, uh, this uh, is a direct, uh, you know, request to the Lord uh, that, my dear Lord, you are the Lord of the creation. Samsara era Nath. Samsara means the whole creation. And Nath means the master. You are the master of the whole creation. Imagine Madha, he was so sinful just a few minutes back and now he is speaking the, he is speaking the conclusions of the Vedas. Hmm? That means that if the Lord gives the mercy to someone and if somebody else sees that mercy or hears about that mercy, then also that person also will be delivered. That is why we are reading Chaitanya Bhagavad because the same benefit Madai got by seeing Jagai's deliverance, we can get the same benefit by seeing, by hearing. But because when we, we, we see by the ear, we can get the same benefit by hearing. So, uh, O Lord of the universe, please do not deceive me. Are kapata. Don't try to hide yourself. Don't try to cheat me. If you want, anything is possible. You say you will not forgive me, but it is up to you. I know I have committed totally the most highest offense, topmost offense in creation, topmost sin. But if you want, it is possible. Only you. And now that my dear Lord, the last argument, this eighth argument, he's trying to really put forth. And he's not just speaking lip talk, he's speaking from the heart, Madhai. He really wants to be delivered. He has understood Gauranga Tattva. So Madhai is saying, Vidita Hailara Lukai Bekat. My dear Lord, you have already revealed yourself in front of Jagai. And I have seen it. And now I know your tattva fully. How can you hide it from me? I already know. I have already seen. I have seen you. How can you hide it? This is the last argument which there is no answer. Because he says, I have already seen. Vidita Haila. You have already appeared like the sun in front of both of us. And Nityananda, Prabhu's mercy, he wants to deliver both of us. So you already appeared. Uh, and now, uh, why are you trying to hide now? Uh, please, my dear Lord. In this beautiful eight uh, petitions of Madhai, every devotee should read this again and again. So that we know when the Lord appears before us, what to pray for. Uh, how to ask him? We know the sequence <laughs> because we are more fallen than Madhai. We have criticized Vaishnava so many times. Madhai had never criticized, at least. Hmm. We have committed so many sins in our previous life, all kinds. So we have to also learn this how to pray to the Lord. Hmm. And what is the solution? Uh, we will uh, see next time.
Uh, about what is the response of Goranga? Whether Goranga is agreed to deliver him or not? And if yes, uh, what is his condition? Thank you. Thank you.